Aha, uh -huh. I'm up early enough for a sunrise. That is a sunrise, people, and it's so beautiful. Just kind of an orange hue everywhere. If this is one time, thank goodness for the trees, or that'd be straight in our face. Hello, this is Glenda with Fraylands and Friends. And I've, well, today we're going to put some stripes on Mr. Zebra, but I can't get him all at once because, well, I can't hold him all at once. And he tends to tip if I do things without holding on to him somewhere. So, and we're going to go out on the porch because once I've got part of him striped, then he has to dry. So we're going to go out on the porch and just be there. Just chat, I guess. But for right now, I'm going to be quiet and let you see me put some stripes. Or I don't know how quiet I'll be. You know how hard that is. Okay. I'm going to point you down toward the zebra. You don't have to look at me. <laughs> okay, there he is. Okay. Oh, I can't do anything without the paint. And he's already painted white, so we need the black stripes. Oh, that came out fast. Well, I don't need that. I'm going to use this kind of thin brush. And I'm shaky. I ain't lying, I'm shaky. So I'm going to try. From what I could see on images that I looked up, they've got this. Ah, oh, darn it. Long stripe down the middle of the back. Well, that is bigger than I wanted it. And then the ones on the side, like this, go down around the belly. Makes me mad I got that one so heavy, so long, so wide. Now, I have heard that no two zebras have exact, the exact same pattern when it comes to stripes. But when I looked online, it looked to me like they have some very similar uh, things about their stripes. Because the ones on the belly seem to go downward on all the ones I saw. And then the ones here go horizontal. Uh, none of my zoo animals are going to look very realistic, I can tell you that much. But I don't think that's a surprise to anybody. <laughs> back here are horizontal. Ah.
This is not working like I wanted it to. I may have to be uh, repaint, I don't know, put white back over that, but I don't know how well that will work. Oh, 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 no, no, no. Okay, he has to dry. Hello, my dear. Hello. I told him that you were hiding. I'm hiding. <laughs> he's not even going to try to hide that he's hiding. I'm hiding. <laughs> Hello there. Aw, now wasn't that sweet of him. Hello there. They can't see it. Well, maybe they can. Oh, wait. Before I forget... Joe, uh, the tub is full of kaboom. Say what? The tub is full of kaboom. I sprayed it with with kaboom. It needs. It's still in there. I was letting it just soak. So you'll need to wipe it out before you take your bath. Well, just rinse it out. Well, then just rinse it out. I don't care. <laughs> I didn't scrub it. You know it is not easy. I don't know what happened to our long handled scrubber. Well, that doesn't help me any. He's just being silly and me. Can't borrow tomorrow. I got a horseshoe set. What can I do to set it up? With the horseshoes. If you want to throw horseshoes, you go set it up. <laughs> He's being mean to me. <laughs> What is that in that yellow bottle? That is windshield de-icer. Oh, that makes sense. Why don't you have it in your car in the winter time? Because, well, this stuff here is supposed to keep it from icing open. It's just a stuff you spray on before the ice is open. I, well, then you could so spray hard. it on before you go into your job. It works. Not, and it's not supposed to be so hard to spray it on. Well, so you spray it on the windshield at night, and then when you get to work, you spray it on again. Yeah, I just forget. <laughs> uh -huh. I got him to admit that I was right. I'm I don't old. know if I am or not, but I got him to admit. I'm old, I forget. <laughs> <laughs> this may be the show. I may forget about the zebra. <laughs> I'm old. <laughs> you know I can't reply to that. So how was your day? Actually not bad. Had my morning nap after I woke up from my all night sleep. Or most of the night sleep. I did, and I rinsed it so it's in the drainer. So I'm gonna blow it out. No, you plug it in so that the machine can. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I said. Okay. Actually, we do honestly give each other a rough time like this. Sometimes when we're not watching TV or he's not sleeping, which is after he takes his nap on Saturday or Sunday. No, I never take naps. You can't sit without taking a nap. <laughs> I am. You know I'm not going to get all of this in on the table. Huh? <laughs> I said, you know I'm not going to get all of this in on the table. Why? I mean, I'll put, a, I'll put a lot of you on there, but the whole time I've been sitting out here. Oh. He doesn't want to be cut out. He's getting to be a camera hog. <laughs> uh -uh. Ooh, quit it. <laughs> tickles. Yeah, it tickles when I want to make it tickle on it. I, I can make it hurt. Too. I know. I don't like it when you pinch. <laughs> it hurts. I don't do that anymore. Because you don't misbehave that much. But you are today. <laughs> no, I'm not. A little horse bite once in a while don't hurt you. Uh oh. What? Uh oh. What? 
Well, I see a piece of chipboard that isn't covered up by the other boards, but is that what you're uh oh No. Well, what are you uh oh Things are starting to move. You mean clouds or the things you above us? In my tummy. Well, get out of here then. <laughs> It was looking up there like there was something wrong above us. Jeez. I gotta do that. I'm glad you are. Goodbye. Right. <laughs> hey, watch out my tubing. We have our zebra. And I all I, all I have left to do really are the hooves. And I might just leave them white. I don't know. This where it was a real thick stripe, I managed to thin that down and then bring some stripes up over the back. Does he look like a zebra or a dog in striped pajamas? <laughs> <laughs> or maybe a horse in striped pajamas. I don't know about the horse or the dog, either one. It's a zebra. My my, uh, <laughs> my my kind of zebra anyway it's been a wonderful day and I'm gonna figure out a way to get this whole zoo thing put together and I think I'm gonna need a bigger board and somebody was showing how they do a base and they take like a piece of board like I've got and they put like foil over it, and then they keep building on top of that for the base. But I don't know that they're making it for a zoo. <laughs> I have enjoyed this so much, and we will get back to doing some more figures. But there's other things we can do, too. Please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Click that notification bell. Come back. Do share it. Our art isn't great, but it's ours. And it's fun. And that's the idea. It needs to be fun. So, good night. I love you. <laughs>